An electron beam is a stream of electrons manipulated by electromagnetic fields to move in the same direction and at the same speed. For over a century, electron beams have played a prominent role in the discovery of microstructures, unlocking the secrets of the natural world. However, these traditional microscopes can only enable structural observation. In order to study atomic movement in these microstructures, it has been necessary to develop ultra-short pulsed electron beams. One of the pioneers in developing methods for efficient generation of controlled, high-intensity, fast electron beams is Professor Jia Zhang. Physicists are constantly exploring nature's limits in order to detect extremely fast atomic movements of microstructures in nature. We have to build an instrument to go smaller, faster, and more precisely than ever before. This means ultra-high spatial and temporal resolution. Over the past two decades, Professor Zhang and his team have used high-intensity fast electrons to make a series of major breakthroughs that may broaden our understanding of how to utilize this technology more efficiently. One such major breakthrough is his team's development of Mega Electron Volt Ultrafast Electron Diffraction Imaging Instrumentation and demonstration of sub-angstrom spatial resolution, culminating in a world record-setting temporal resolution of 50 femtoseconds. The high resolution allows scientists to observe how the atoms move to invert a periodic lattice distortion within 100 femtoseconds. This new tool has led to new discoveries. For instance, it provides an atomic view of how phonons, a definite discrete unit of vibrational mechanical energy, couple and decay in materials such as bismuth. Professor Zhang and his team have also pioneered the combination of ultrafast electron diffraction and an intense laser pulse to manipulate electronic dimensionality of a quantum material, succeeding in producing and observing exotic phenomena such as light-induced superconductivity. This same combination has additionally opened new research directions in condensed matter physics, chemical physics, and high-energy particle accelerators. To explore the limits of high-energy density states in nature, we have to go much denser and hotter than anywhere on Earth. This means we have to create extremely high pressure in very small space and at very short time scale. In fact, these conditions are even more extreme than those in the core of the sun. Zhang's research on fast electron beams was initially driven by the prospect of inertial confinement fusion, ICF, which, if realized, has the potential to produce clean energy in the future. Traditionally, ICF has used lasers to compress and ignite fuel at the same time, a process prone to instability. A more efficient way, called fast ignition, separates the fuel compression and ignition, allowing optimization of these two processes independently while avoiding instabilities. However, fast ignition has its challenges in how to precisely inject the heating electron beam to the right position and at the right time in very dense plasmas. In addressing these challenges, Zhang and his team have developed a new approach by firstly reaching the fusion density in the collision from two cones where the fuel shells are compressed and accelerating. Ultra-short pulsed high-energy electron beams are then used to heat up the colliding plasma to the ignition temperature, aiming at a more efficient fusion process. Zhang has spared no efforts on demonstration of his new concept, even during the most difficult time of the pandemic period in the beginning of 2020. This might be the most dangerous fusion experiment in the world, where all his team members had to wear masks all the time, like medical doctors. As China enters the era of carbon peaking and carbon neutrality, fusion should play an important role in fulfilling our energy needs. This unlimited clean energy can move our world away from fossil fuels and promises to be the future for China and the world. For his development of laser-based fast electron beam technologies and their applications in ultra-fast, time-resolved electron microscopy and fast ignition for research towards inertial confinement fusion, the 2021 Future Science Prize in Physical Science goes to Professor Jia Zhang.